people, his days may be numbered. Well, it's sad, but volunteers held something special tonight to help with the dog's recovery. WJCL's Ashley Lincoln joins us now with more on that, and we wish him well. Yes, we do, Kevin and Jennifer. Now, the dog was and still is in very bad shape, so tonight, rescue organizers held Hugs for Bama. It's an opportunity to show a neglected dog that a little love and affection can go a long way. Basically, went on a wing and a prayer in the hopes that maybe we weren't too late. X-rays showed rocks in his stomach. In the very least, that he would know some compassion and comfort and love in whatever days we could give him. Giving a neglected dog much needed attention in the form of a hug. Can we get him through tonight? Can we get him through tomorrow? Volunteers with Coastal Pet Rescue held hugs for Bama. Bama, whose days may be numbered, got to see what human love and affection really is. To have some attention, I think, is a big deal for him. The bulldog was brought to the Beaufort County Animal Shelter Saturday, clinging on to life, suffering from starvation and neglect. Looking at him, he had been like that for a long time. Lisa Scarbo with Coastal Pet Rescue brought him here to Animal Shelter Rice Hope for medical attention. Volunteers say the dog's condition was one of the worst they've seen, with failing kidneys, ulcers, and glaucoma. I had absolutely no idea the extent of his poor condition until I was face to face with him. Volunteers say if he doesn't get surgery, his days may be numbered. Like right now, he's in renal failure. But Bama's hugs won't stop at the clinic. This has been a lot harder than I thought it would be. We're bringing Bama home tonight, and it's going to be a hard night for me. But at least Bama's going to know what it's like to be a part of a family, even if it's just one night that we get with him. Volunteers in Bama are taking it one day at a time. Our, our hope is that he will have a wonderful night tonight. He will see how loved that he is. He'll know what a gentle touch and loving touch and compassion is. And then we will worry about the rest tomorrow. And the outpouring from Facebook has been really good. You can make donations for Obama's medical treatments, and we have all of that information on our website at WJCL.com. But Kevin and Jennifer, volunteers, just wanted that dog to receive a little love and affection in case things turn out for the worse. And experience what it's like to be a part of a family. Yes. Oh, that's so sweet. That's so nice, Elisa. Yes, heart-touching. Yeah. All right, we're pulling for you, Bama. Yeah. All right, thank you.